Hi, Elaine Marilaco Settleson with Astrology Channel ETC. We're talking about the lunar eclipse in Aries, where it can be a blast, where it can be this whole new detonation of idea. Uh, October 8th is the day, remember to add a week to October 1st, and we're going to extend it all the way through mid-November. During this time frame, October 1st through, let's say, November 15th or so, you're going to have this impetus, this feeling, this spontaneous tenacity that wants to explode through you, especially if you've got a lot of Aries planets in your chart. And this is a really great thing, but remember we're also in a Mercury in retrograde during this time. So ideas are going to come like this. Keep a pen and pad handy, keep a phone, you know, call your agent <laughs> with your ideas. But the bigger issue is the combination of the retrograde in Scorpio and this Aries lunar eclipse you're going to have some insight into your own feminine behavior. So what can that mean? Are you passive? Are you passive aggressive? Are you um, too trusting? I don't know if there is such a thing, but you do need to set boundaries. Are you someone who is so excited all the time and happy? And now you just want to, you know, take a vacation from the world. It's okay. No matter what you experience, there's going to be a lot of energy in the month of October. I want you to keep on how you're feeling and take note of all those brainstorms that you're going to have. And we're going to continue the conversation. If you like what you hear, please join me on my website, on Facebook, and on the YouTube channel, Astrology Channel ETC.